Guys, if you want to upgrade any of your PCs to Windows 11 but your PC doesn't support Windows 11 and you're seeing a system requirement error, then in today's video I will show you how you can easily bypass this error and install Windows 11 on your unsupported PC or laptop. To do this process, you'll need a few files. First, you will need to download the Windows 11 ISO file and second, you'll need to download 7-zip. If you have already downloaded both files, that's great. If not, then simply open any browser. Now here go to the search box and type here Windows 11 ISO and search it then click on the first result download Windows 11. Once you click on it then scroll down and you will see the option download Windows 11 disk image. Click on select download choose Windows 11 multi edition ISO and then click on download now. Now you will be asked to choose a language. Click on the drop down select English United States and then click confirm. Now you will see the download link. Click on 64-bit download and your ISO file will start downloading. I have already downloaded it so I will close this but you have to wait until your download is completed. Next you will also need to download 7-zip to extract ISO file. To do that open new tab and search for 7-zip in your browser. Click on the first website that appears. Here you will get the download option just click download and download it. I have already downloaded it so I will close this window too. Once both files are downloaded, exit your browser and go to the folder where you saved them. Now first, right click on the 7-zip setup file and click run as administrator. Click yes to allow, then click install. Once 7-zip is installed on your computer, then click on close. Now go to the Windows 11 ISO file and right click on it, then click extract files and then here you need to click on OK button then the ISO file will begin to extract. Once the file is extracted, open the Windows 11 folder that you just extracted. Inside, you will see a file called setup. This is what we will use to install Windows 11. Now if I run it directly, for that I have to right click on it and then click on run as administrator. Then yes, here you will see the installation page opened. Now if I click on next, it will start checking my PC. And as you can see, it clearly says that this PC doesn't currently meet Windows 11 system requirements and it even shows the reasons. So now we'll use a simple trick to install Windows 11 on an unsupported PC. Click cancel to close this window. Once you close it, now go to the Windows search bar and type CMD. Right click on command prompt and click run as administrator. If any permissions appear, click yes to allow. Now command prompt will open. Next, go to the sources folder inside your extracted Windows 11 ISO file. Click on the address bar at the top, right click and copy the full address. Now come back to command prompt. Type cd give a space and then paste the address you just copied. Press enter. Now cmd is set to that folder. Here you will need to type a command. This command is also available in the video description or you can copy it from the screen. Type setup prep.exe give a space and then type slash product give a space and server once you type it then press enter now the windows installation process will begin click next and it will check your pc this time instead of showing any requirement error it will directly take you to the license agreement click on accept then it will start checking some update then you will see the choose what to keep option select the first option Keep files, settings and apps then click on next and it will do some more checks. Now it will show ready to install. Click install and the installation process will begin. Wait for a while your PC will restart during the process and after that Windows 11 will be successfully installed on your unsupported PC. So guys this was a simple method that you can follow to bypass the minimum system requirements of Windows 11 on any unsupported PC. I hope this video helped you. If it did please subscribe to the channel and give this video a like. See you in the next one. Till then, stay safe and thanks for watching.